Kaduna, the state government says at least 387 persons have been killed in Zango Kataf and Kauru local government areas within the last two years. This is due to communal conflicts between the Atyap Hausa and Fulani and Irigwe communities living there. In the wake of renewed conflicts and killings in the region, Governor Nasir El Rafai on Wednesday sent a delegation led by the State Internal Security Commissioner Samuel Aruan to meet with stakeholders from aggrieved communities in order to resolve their differences. He appealed to them to sheath their swords and recourse to the law. So, so we are building uh, agreed uh, to build a fort operating base here. So you can see from Angongo Chile to Zongo Urban to Angongo Hogo to Matse, you know, uh, connecting to uh, the Angongaya general uh, area. So we can be able uh, to respond to uh, any uh, distress call within the general area. So this is part of the effort of strengthening uh, security uh, here. And uh, Kaduna State Government is grateful. Well, meanwhile, the Nigerian Defense Headquarters has also approved the establishment of an additional operational base within the region to serve as a buffer zone and to reduce hostilities. The base will be located on the plot of land, which was the major cause of contention, uh, contention rather, that gave rise to the Zangon Kataf crisis of 1992. More troops have also been deployed by the Defense Headquarters to the area to strengthen military operations against criminality and ethnic violence.